الحمد للہ وسلاۃ وسلام علی رسول اللہ وعلیٰ علی وصاب اجمعین اما آباد اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم کل یا اہل الکتاب تعال الا قلم تن سوا ام بین بین کم اللہ نا ابدا اللہ ولا نشرق بھی شیوں ولا تخیز آباد دن آباد دن ارب آبن بندن اللہ فن تو اللہ فق الشد بین مسلم رب شلی صدری و یسلی عمری واہل العبد تم السان یف کہ کولی my respected elders and my dear brothers and sisters i welcome all of you with islamic greetings assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh may peace mercy and blessings of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala of almighty god be on all of you it's a pleasure and honor for me that for the three consecutive sessions in the peace exhibition the vision of islam I have been asked to give the concluding speech. The topic of this evening's talk is the concept of God in world's major religions. Religion, according to the Oxford Dictionary, means a belief in a superhuman controlling power, especially a personal God or gods that deserve worship and obedience. In short, according to the Oxford Dictionary, religion means the belief in God. I start my talk by quoting a verse from the Glorious Quran from Surah Al Imran, chapter number 3, verse number 64, which says, Kul ya hilal kitab, say, O people of the book, Ta'alo ila kalmitin sawa im bayna bayna kum. Come to common terms as between us and you. Which is the first term? Allah na abda illallah that we worship none but Allah. Wala nushrika bihi shayyon that we associate no partners with him. Wala yattaqiz abad dun abad dun arbab min dun illah that we erect not among ourselves lords and patrons other than Allah. Fain tawallah if they turn back. Fakul shadu e bear witness be anna muslimun that we are Muslims bowing our will to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. This verse of the glorious Quran according to me I call it the master key for da'wah. Whenever we speak to different types of people, people of different religions, the Quran says, Come to common terms as between us and you. Though the verse begins by saying, Kul ya hilal kitab, Say, O people of the book, this verse can be used for people of all religions. It specifically refers to the Jews and Christians, but in general, it can refer to the people of all religions. And the first term is Allah na buddha illallah, that we worship none but Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Almighty God. One thing common, alhamdulillah, in all the world's major religions is that the followers of any religion, they believe that the God they worship is the same for themselves as well as for others. For example, the God which the Hindus worship, they believe he is the God for the Hindus as well as for the non-Hindus. The God with the Christian worship, they believe he is the same God for the Christians as well as the non-Christians. And the God which we Muslims believe, we believe that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, Almighty God, is the same God for the Muslims as well as for the non-Muslims. 